Hey everyone and welcome back. An Inside Star Citizen episode has dropped yesterday with kind of like an origin story for one of the developers there. In particular, Will Price, who is the gameplay capture artist for a lot of Inside Star Citizen's B-roll. After the origin story of Will comes an all-vehicle kind of sprint report, including the Drake Corsair, which has moved into Greybox, its first stages into Greybox. The Drake Vulture, which is going through Final Art Pass uh, with LODs and the Wear and Tear Shader as seen here. The Scorpius has Final Art on one of the wings, which the other three are just going to be duplicated. As well as entry points and uh, some extra tents for the Scorpius. Um, and, big one, the Banu Merchantman has some white box interior updates, including the medical center, the security room, and the WC suite, as well as exterior of the enormous landing gear, which kind of reminds me of a giant paw. As well as the whole sea interior, you got this beautiful shot of the whole sea interior, which as stated in the ISC, the whole sea will come with a tractor beam and a remote camera UI using the building blocks tech, which is freaking awesome. I do know that CIG is planning to hire a ton of developers to work. Now, they're essentially looking to double their workforce. According to Pipeline, a lot of devs are now working on Squadron 42. Of course, we know that Chris Roberts has moved to the UK to kind of work on Squadron 42 full time. And seeing that there's a ton of developers working on Squadron 42 now, that is awesome. And that does not necessarily take things away from the PC you to kind of reassure you as far as the PU a lot of the gameplay features that have made it into Squadron 42 will actually be created and polished in Squadron 42 and then migrated over to the PU and that's going to be how it kind of works so it's not taking away anything really from the PU also I just got word from CIG that they will not be doing the Star Citizen Live today it has been cancelled due to the world events going on right now but uh yeah that's about it for this video and tell me what you guys think i mean do you guys think that squadron 42 could possibly come out by the end of this year uh do you think server meshing is gonna come out by quarter three quarter four i mean at least the first kind of phase of it um have you guys experienced some of these kind of dynamic kind of spawn times with jump town what's your guys opinion on the banding merchantman is it a ship that you love or have you bought one or not are you excited for it? What are your thoughts? And I will see you guys in the next one.